back here in Atlantic City as we continue on our coverage of the Atlantic City Pickleball Open. Dave Ben's along with you as we bring you game two of this men's pro doubles first round match between Side out. Kyle Yates, Rob Cassidy against Manny Lai and Alex Sipkowski. Mentioned Sipkowski zero, zero, and Lai are both from the Jersey area. Manny Lai moved here at 12 years old from Hong Kong. Meantime, Second Alex serve. grew up in Philadelphia and then was raised in Marlton, New Jersey. Currently lives in Hamilton. Zero, zero, two. And Alex is in the, I believe that's a old school Quebec Nordiques t-shirt. And he is a pickleball instructor in the light blue in the far Side court out. as his full-time occupation. Manny Lai, meantime, is a CPA and accountant. Zero, zero, one. Lai and Sipkowski, Second they serve. actually had a great start to their first game. Zero, had zero, the lead, two. I believe it was 6-2. Before Yates and Cassidy rolled off five points and forged ahead Point. to win the match 11-6. They actually rolled off nine straight points to win it 11-6. One, zero, two. Lion, Sapkowski get off to the first lead of this one as well. If you caught the very beginning of our broadcast when we went on the air at 11 a.m. Eastern, Kyle Yates was talking about how fun this tournament has been, but also the amount of work it is. Side out. Taking a, on everybody to get this thing off the ground. And Kyle is telling me right now that he Zero, is one, absolutely one. running on res the reserve tank. He told me before we started today that today was the first day of the week that he got up and he was like, oof, even a good night of sleep really didn't uh, reset me. He's been here for over a week. He's been here early every single day trying to make sure that everything is just right for all the players, the volunteers, the Second serve. people that are over in the vendor tents. He's, he's just trying to make sure that everybody has everything that they need. And on top of that, he's, he's trying to put Zero, on a one, show two. and play at a high level of pickleball. And you've got to tip your cap to Kyle for all the things that he has done. And he's been a big part of getting us here this week. So. We are very thankful to be a part of this. And uh, Kyle, right on cue, comes up with a, a winning shot there. And the first point of this game one, for Nathan Cassidy. Side out. And the side out will get it back over to Lai and Sipkowski. So Sapkowski to start off one, this one, one. serve opportunity, as you might have guessed, based upon his T-shirt, his favorite hobby or activity other than pickleball is hockey. Nice. Second serve. Move to Manny Lai. One, one, two. Says so his favorite food is pickles. Favorite movie of all time is Elf. And his favorite all-time athlete is, is Kelly Lai, who is his wife and who introduced him to pickleball three years ago. One, Lyon. one, one. Sapkowski unable to do anything with that serve opportunity, however, and back off the side out to Cassidy and Yates. And quickly now to the second serve. One, one, two. Point there. Yes, sir. Total of 12 two, one, two. teams are in this men's pro doubles division oh. here in Atlantic City. Cassidy pulls off the ATP, then able to get back. But finally, the exchange is won by Lai and Sipkowski. They'll force the side out. How about the ground that Rob Cassidy covered there? One, two, one. But Gates kind of got caught in no man's land as he was drifting back between the kitchen and the baseline. Stop. Yates for the Ernie, Second and serve. that ends that exchange. 
One, two, two. So one, two, two now. Side out. And the serve headed back over to Yates and Cassidy with this 2-1 lead. 2-1-1. One, one. Mary Bittner, the referee for this match. After this one concludes, we'll see the senior pro doubles on the court for the first time today. That match will involve Point. the team of Hollander and Alvarado. And Three, one, one. Gerald Alvarado has been fantastic when he's been out there all week long. So we'll see how he can do in the mixed senior pro doubles. Second serve. Three, one, two. Three, one, two as Yates takes over the serve. Point. And Sapkowski a little bit frustrated with his execution on that one. Four, one, two. Yates Side up. got a little bit under that one. Looking at looking at Rob Cassidy, and he knows his his angle with which he held that paddle was to blame one, four, for that one. shot going too high. By the way, we, we talked yesterday about getting our crew out on center Second court, serve. and some of us did have a chance to get out there and play a little bit yesterday after the one, four, matches two. wrapped up on our coverage. Thankfully, the cameras were shut down at that point. Because I don't think anybody really needed to see that. But uh, no, we had a lot of fun. Our executive producer, Ray Koliakovo, he teamed with Billy, who's the DJ here, entertaining everybody between matches. And I was able to Point. line up next to Caitlin Bailey, who's our A2. And it was the first time she had ever played. And I think we I think we held our own. We, we ended up, I think, 11-7 was the two. final. We, we got one game in, then we, then we gave up the court to the people from Splish, Matt, Eric, and Jamie. And Jack, who's part of the marketing team here. Hopefully, there will be a little bit more time to be able to play today. Yeah! Oh, Yates pulls off his Side second out. Ernie in this game. And that'll get a, an ovation out of the crowd. Four, two, one. So the serve back over to Yates and Cassidy at four, two. Second serve. Cassidy such quick hands, but four, two, two. unable to finish off that one. Point. For those of you watching the live stream, there will be a live stream Five, two, two. tomorrow as well, although tomorrow will be just a little bit different as the three championship matches in the pro division that we will be broadcasting will also be what we call in the business live to tape. So it'll be getting recorded for airing on CBS Sports Network. Point. Timeout. Timeout going to be taken here by Lai and Sipkowski as six, it's 6-2 two, two, in game two. 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 We'll take a quick breather as well. More to come from Atlantic City, New Jersey. The Atlantic City Pickleball Open is brought to you by Dietz and Watson. It's a family thing. Total pickleball, lowest prices guaranteed. By Clover Health. Why not more great days? By Splish Naturals Sport. Everyone deserves wellness. By the Atlantic City Sports Commission. When it comes to sports event planning, no one else can compete. And by Meet AC. Atlantic City means business. Gotta love that sand sculpture here in Atlantic City. 
It has been just a delight to be here in this building. Yesterday was yesterday was perfect because it rained outside and it was nice and dry inside. And by the time we got out of here yesterday, what do you know? The rain was no longer here. So that was uh, that was very nice. Uh, temperatures did drop a little bit, though. It was, I actually had to have, wear a sweatshirt in my walk over from Caesars to the Atlantic City Convention Center today. First time I had to do that all week. So summer is, uh, there are probably a, still a few, few warm days left in this part of the country, but they are going to become fewer and further between here Two, as six, summer one. gives way to autumn. Great time of the year to be in this part of the country, though. You get to see the changing of the leaves, the fall colors. As long as you're, as long as you're okay with putting on a sweatshirt, you'll love it here. So if you're watching this live stream from somewhere saying, I should be in Atlantic City next year. Yes, you should. September 18th through 23rd is when the Atlantic City Pickleball Open will be conducted next year here in this Atlantic City Convention Center. Point. Kyle Yates into the net, so the unforced error, and Lyon Sapkowski able to get three, it to six, three two. six. Sapkowski for Yates. Sapkowski sped Side it up, up and Yates defended well. I couldn't handle it. So we'll move to 3 6 2. Excuse six, me, that three, was the one. side out. So it's 6 3 1 now. Yo, go, go. Cassidy able to catch up to it. Wow, what great quick feet and quick hands by Cassidy. And then Yates executes the lob to perfection. Manny Lai, as soon as that went up over his head, he was like, I really can't do anything with that other than hope that it's going to go deep and go out of bounds. Seven, three, one. Ball, wrong receiver. Point. Oh, a mental error there. Oh, no, check that. Wrong receiver, not the wrong server, wrong receiver. So the mental error is on Lai and Sapkowski. And that is a point for Yates and Cassidy, now just three points away from closing out this Eight, match. Three, one. Point. Yates lets it go, so make it 9-3. Timeout. Lyons of Kowski are going to use one. their final timeout. We'll take a break as well. 9-3, two points away from moving on are Yates and Cassidy. This championship match brought to you by Dietz and Watson. It's a family thing. Total pickleball, lowest prices guaranteed. Clover Health, why not more great days? Splish Naturals Sport, everyone deserves wellness. The Atlantic City Sports Commission, when it comes to sports event planning, no one else can compete. And meet AC, Atlantic City means business. Back here in Atlantic City. Happy to have you on board as we continue our coverage all week long from this fantastic Dietz and Watson Atlantic City Pickleball Open. Kyle Yates and Rob Cassidy looking to close this one out. Nine, three, one. It was 11 6, or excuse me, it was 6 2 in game one in favor of Lai and Sapkowski. And since that point, it's been Nine, three, Gates two. and Cassidy absolutely seizing control of this match. Point. And that's going to bring up match point. So match point number one is Yates will look to 10, three, two. close this one out. I talked about Kyle telling me that he's, he's on the reserve tank of fuel at this point after a long week. But he said, you know, once I get out there and start playing, I think I'll be fine. And it looks to me like that has been the case in this, in this game. Took him a little bit to get started. 
But uh, he looks like he has found his footing. Three, ten, one. Tried to execute the Ernie to end it there, but into the net. So still hanging on our Lion Sipkowski, but they are in Point. a deep hole. 4-10 after that point. 4-10-1. Gates a couple of overheads. Lion Sipkowski finally do get off that baseline. Second serve. Just in time to hit it into the tape. 4-10-2. Great backhand by Cassidy. You. Yates with Hitch. the dink with some ah. English on it. And finally, Sipkowski with the power. Hitch. Pretty ah. decent crowd on hand here at the convention center yes, for this match, which started Five, ten, on the AM side of the clock. Now just after noon here in Go. New Jersey. Yeah. I guess a lot of these fans that are watching right now are our friends Point. of Lyon Sipkowski. And they're happy with what they're seeing right now because the local fellows are making a little bit of a run here. They've closed it to 6-10. 6-10-2. Side out. Side out, gets it back over to Yates and Cassidy. So this will be match point number two. 10, six, one. Ooh, Second serve. Miss fire on the Backhand there by Yates. Match Ten, six, point two. number three. Side out. And it's going to have to wait. Lion Sipkowski hanging tough. We saw yesterday on this court the team of Heim. Six, ten, one. And her partner, going off the top of my head here, Debbie Drum, it was Hyman Drum. They staved off 13 elimination points before finally falling in a match that went not only three games, but then a race to 15. As JC Parr and Kelsey Grambeau were able to win the 4 5 5 0. 19 plus 35 plus combined division for Six, ten, two. women's doubles yesterday. It was, it, it was an unbelievable match. Your Kyle say at the top of the broadcast that it may have been the best pickleball match he'd ever seen. Point. And right now, Sipkowski and Lai are giving Yates and Cassidy a run in game two. Seven ten two. Seven ten two. You almost wonder one more point if Gates and Cassidy might use a timeout. Nice shot, bro. Great Side shot out. by Cassidy, though. Lai couldn't catch up to it, and now we're going to get another match point. This will be match point number four. Ten seven one. It's a long shot by Yates and match point number five. Yates and Cassidy having a difficult time closing this 10, one 7, out. 2. And that's going to be it. Hit long by Sipkowski. 
You see Rob Cassidy applaud the effort, though, of their opposition. They made him work, but in the end, it is Yates and Cassidy, the number one seed, moving on in the winner's bracket. Lyon Sipkowski will go down to the loser's bracket. Don't see, be surprised if they make some noise, though. The Jersey boys acquitted themselves very well here on center court. Don't go anywhere. Our coverage from Atlantic City will continue after this timeout.